What's good, y'all? Back in with another one of Rainy's Book Clubs. And this week we have Michael Pollan's How to Change Your Mind with the New Science of Psychedelics teaches us about consciousness, dying, addiction, depression, and transcendence. And while that title is a mouthful, this book is definitely worth the read. Um, Pollan talks about his experience with psychedelics or lack thereof as he's approaching his 60s um, and how that pretty much kind of caused, um, it was a catalyst for his his research in writing this book. He was like, well, I've never done these, and everybody always talks about their experiences and all these spiritual and mystical experiences that they, they encounter. And he's like, I'm an atheist. I don't believe in any of that stuff, but I kind of want to see what this is about. And so he starts to do his research, finds out the history and details that in the book of how psychedelics became um, became about and how they ended up becoming illegal. Um, and he talks about his own personal experiences on these drugs and the different type of psychedelics or entheogens that he takes um, throughout his life um, and how they were really eye-opening and how um, different people have been using it now. And we've seen this resurgence um, in like the, you know, 2015, 2000, well, starting with 2006 and on um, of people realizing the power that these that these drugs can, can, um, can give people, whether it be people dealing with depression, um, PTSD, anxiety, um, alcohol addiction, or any really type of addiction. Um, and yeah, people I think are starting to kind of open their eyes to stuff like that. But he also talks about the dark side of psychedelics and how people will misuse them. Talks about MK Ultra, which I highly recommend reading about too as well if you've never heard about that. Um, and um, just different people who who just take advantage of it. And kind of similar to with every other drug, you know, there's always going to be people who abuse it. And it really just depends on the eye of the beholder and making sure that you put it in the right people's hands. So yeah, recommend checking this book out.